guys and welcome back to a new video today i'm right here in bern at emil frey auto center at kia and i have with me the new kia sorento and i will drive it for you guys if you want to see the test drive stay with me until the end of the video also if you are new here click the subscribe button if you want to see the newest car that come on the market and also if you want to see the review full review with this new kia sorento check it out on my channel i have there the full review you can get the information about the car you can see the space the quality materials and the price and technical details but until then let's make the test drive and then we will talk at the end about the experience so let's do it guys All right, guys, let's drive the new Kia Sorento seven seater. Before we start driving, guys, you can see the car come with automatic uh, electric adjustable seats and also safe position for later when you go inside the car. The car will go in the position that you save before you go out and your choice here. So this is great to have this option. As you probably see in my other review, guys, if you didn't see the full review with this new Kia Sorento, check it out on my channel there. You can see all the information. You can see the space in the back. You can see uh, the quality materials. You can see information about the car, the battery, the, the motor. And also I will give you some information. The, the price of this car with all the option that it's on this Kia Sorento with uh, electric seats, uh, heated seats, ventilated seats, new multimedia system from Kia and uh, also all this leather, 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 everywhere leather, this glass roof that it's amazing uh, and also head up display and all that safety features. Um, yeah, check it out on my other video. The price is 62,000 francs, around 64, 64,000 dollars. The car come with a uh, 1.6 liter petrol engine TGDI and the hybrid system together they work to give you the best uh, horsepower I think 350 Newton meters I will leave all those information in the video as well uh, but yeah I don't want to go too much into detail about uh, the car I will give you some information as we go the, the consumption around 7.5 and also uh, the car have 2032 kilograms uh, 180 horsepower is only the petrol engine also you have a discount here guys if you come at Emil Frey uh, Auto Center in Bern in Switzerland so they have so some great great prices also you can check them out on the internet emilfrey.ch slash Bern they are super nice they have great service very nice people right here guys so check them out I really recommend you uh, but until then let's drive it and let me give you that impression that feeling about how is to drive because i feel like it's a premium car i know the car i make a review i drive it a little bit and it's a, a really premium car i have to tell you that this sorrento goes in the premium um, list for sure from my opinion and here you have also touch screen buttons led light touch screen buttons that's awesome you have this glass roof that's amazing you can also open it up if you need more air uh, aluminum pedals press the pedals start stop engine button and you can see new digital cockpit from kia also here you have new multimedia system uh, from kia and hyundai they work together they make a great job together you have head-up display right there i don't know if you can see it but it's very nice directly on the windscreen uh, i hope you see it you can adjust the steering wheel in every position you want manually from here leather steering wheel great grip great controls i like also here you can customize your cockpit the way you want it there so you can see the speed you can see the echo we will leave it like this so you can see the energy flow driving assistance systems you have so many so many options 
to customize there so it's a very nice one it's it's an it's the new one and it's great that for example here if you drive in echo mode you can change the different driving mode you can go to echo sport smart and then if you press it you go terrain you go off-road snow mud sand so every time you change those information you go in sport mode you change the the graphics and then it's smart mode it gives you the best uh sport performance and best economy and if you go to terrain snow mud and sand yes sir we drive in echo mode for the first time only in ev mode you can drive only in ev mode the multimedia system it's amazing i have a full review with it if you want to see the multimedia system review the new one from kia check it out on my channel you will find it there it's it's awesome one of the best multimedia system also you have touch screen buttons you have shortcut button it's a big screen you have good visibility from the driver point of view great visibility on the windows as well also you have this wheel to change the gear the gear shifter it's wireless the same as you find it on the uh, ford for example also if you go to reverse guys in reverse you have 360 degrees camera and you can also zoom in and zoom out how cool is that you are able to zoom in and zoom out this is awesome also you have parking sensors in the front in the back 360 degrees camera and also when you go in reverse the the windows the the mirrors will fold a little bit so you can you can see down there while you're parking you can see right now it's folding up again now forward camera right now you can see the camera in the front and also from here you can choose what you like to see check this out you can choose what camera you like to see i don't want to go too much into details about that but it's awesome and the cameras have very good resolution now we are in drive mode you can drive only in electric mode for a few kilometers until if you still have battery for example you can see there i have half battery right now if you still have battery you can drive only in electric mode in the city for example it's a great system with with very good um, result in terms of economy the the head-up display is very nice you have a very good visibility there on the cockpit i like it very much um yeah wow look at this i never think about that you see that on the cockpit look at this guys when you go left or right you can see the mirror right here on the cockpit oh my god and then on the other side shit man i like that i never expect that i didn't see that before i go right you want you gonna go right and you can see right here what you see there the camera show you in the back oh man you see it guys how cool is that i never see that before on a car i think this is really and and the camera are really premium look at this oh man it's it's amazing going back in reverse you have such a good visibility i think this is one of the best system i don't know if mercedes or other premium porsche or stuff like that i, I never see that before wow so kia god kia in a few years if, if it goes in the same rhythm it will go between the best i go left and i can see the camera i can still see the camera right there oh wow wow that that's that feature is new even for me it's new i never see it before yay yay i like that i like to see new stuff in new cars and kia really impressed me wow and you can see even if someone with bicycle comes how cool is that you have everything right there in front of you look at this if someone with bicycle come you can see it very well you have good visibility by the way on the windows and in the mirrors you have very good visibility guys also in the back there oh i like it by the way let me talk about the feeling the first impression being in this kia sorento i like very much the seats they are so comfortable one of the best seats on the market today in my opinion kia makes some amazing seats i test the cars i think was the xseed if you didn't see it check it out on my channel the review with kia xseed there you can see guys i test it and the seats was so good and those seats are perfect i mean you have heated seat you have ventilated seat you have also this nice new climatic system integrated very well here you can uh, you can press the things and choice different um 
function super easy you can turn it off from here if you want to I will leave it on just for the purpose of the video but first impression I like the steering wheel it's quite nice it's quite soft and easy even if you have even if this is a big huge SUV car you have a good control you feel like you're under control and I like it I feel like the the suspension are also good I take some bumps until now and they feel pretty good to be honest visibility the tall driving position are perfect I think they should sell a lot of cars like that because it's just awesome and I like that when you go right and I see that camera there man I love it even if you drive at high speeds you can still see in the camera there what's happening how cool is that nah, I want that on my car also you can see the energy flow right there in the front when the car regenerate the energy in the battery right now it's regenerating the battery the car can read also the traffic speed limit and you can see 60 here we have the 60 driving speed limit you can see the navigation pretty well here in the front um, pretty impressive I like it to be honest I like what I see I like even the navigation system look pretty awesome uh, and it's one of the best I try it already on the, on many cars on Hyundai as well and wow I like it I like what I see I think they did a great job also right now we are in eco mode but I can change for example in sport mode a little bit later in smart mode the car will choice between the performance and uh, between the performance and the economy so it will give you the best best from both worlds if you go in sport mode the car will give you the maximum power you can see even the cockpit is changing right now and even in sport mode you can see these mirrors when you go right here when you turning signals right or left you will see that camera right there right now it's in the sport mode and if you need the power if you accelerate let's try the acceleration The gearbox is also good, the brakes are great, really smooth. I like very much, guys, to be honest, I like very much the pedals. When you press the pedals, press the acceleration, it is really, really smooth. I like those aluminum pedals very much. Right now, the car changed the gears a little bit later. quite smooth and also you cannot hear so much noise from outside that's something that I like it let me go back in echo I want to be more silent I want the gear to change a little bit sooner so it will be more relaxing more comfortable way so right now it's acceleration it's much more slower and much more quieter super super nice I like it I like the ride it feels like a premium car um, that was my my purpose and not only that the interior and the exterior look like a premium car and it has a lot of great materials in the interior here but even when you drive the car it feels like you are driving a premium car and that's that's super super impressive for uh, for Kia I think they bring a lot of quality these days in the cars also right now the car regenerate uh, some energy you can see right now also I like those cameras I like I like to turn the signals on this car because I can see that camera is so so fun oh, I like this feature I never see it before and oh I wish I can see it in the future on many cars I don't know who has this idea but if you see the video if you see my video you did a great job i love this camera man it's so cool it's so useful it's like i don't even need to look on the mirror there because i have everything right here even better than tesla they have such a great idea look at this guys how cool is that i think it's awesome man kia oh 
big mi mirrors guys great visibility on the windows i like very much the visibility uh but most one of my favorite thing are those seats and from here you can turn on the heating seat or ventilated seats you can see how cool how easy it is to turn this on and off and all those buttons chrome design buttons they feel so nice so good quality also by the way guys i forget to tell you you have the bay you have an amazing sound you have the Bose sound system in the car so you have an amazing sound if you hear if you listen music here even on the small spaces let's see how easy it is to turn the car here on this small space going in reverse and you can see that the mirrors are dimming you can see in the back it's super super simple going forward just like that so easy the turning radius i want to test it as well Ooh. very nice it has the Bose sound system so it, you have also an amazing sound in the car very nice very nice relaxing ride i like the car very much guys really impressed with what kia did with this car you, you can adjust the seats in every position you want electrically you can leave it also down like a sporty feeling of driving so i like it very much also as i you see before you can go in snow mode or you can go in mud sand you can go off-road with the car a little bit but that's great you have a four-wheel drive right here if you go in, in the sport again right now change the dials try another acceleration see how is the handlings the, 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 the suspension are great let's see here the handlings on the curves oh pretty nice wow it stays so good on the curves i think the car come with individual suspension wow the suspension are quite good it stays so good you don't feel like a boat usually in those big suv you feel like you're in a, on a boat but you in this Kia I don't feel like you are in, on the boat so that's quite impressive it stays so good man I'm quite impressed really really so big car and usually you have to feel like you are on the boat but I think they, they did I don't know which type of suspension they use but they did a great job I think really really great job nice 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 handlings as well great suspension great comfort over the bumps the seats are awesome the steering wheel it's easy to use you don't have any problem in terms of steering wheel all right go in echo mode again driving more slowly even here guys even here the the turning radius it's quite good for such a big car we are in the roundabout right here nice nice ride and very silent and there are so many cars outside here and you can hear nothing inside they did a great job also with the sound insulation inside the car so i like that very much and you have to wait here just wait 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 it turn, doesn't turn signals you have a space you go in and then we wait calm and simple you leave some people to pass by if you if you have to wait forward so you have to to always look in the mirrors always look in the left and the right what other people do and that why it's happened accidents guys because you you have to look always you have to think forward stay safe and be careful guys i drive the cars for 16 years 16 years and i never had an accident because i always pay attention i always drive safe i always look in the mirrors i never drive too fast or too slow so yeah anyway let's go back to the car it's a ride a pleasant ride also by the way guys i forget to tell you that the car come also with adaptive cruise control of course if you press this button down here lane assist of course and you can 
turn it on and off then you have the mode here so you can see I set up the cruise control and the car can keep the distance on the highway it's working really good it's safe put the hand on the steering wheel right now but it's there for me the car can do that as well he say keep the hand on the steering wheel also I really recommend you to do that but you can put it a little bit then lift it and then the car will steer for you will accelerate for me I don't do nothing this is working very well on the highway and really not recommended to use it on this this kind of road and always always turn the signals the other people have to see where are you going if I don't turn the signal it's logic that I make the roundabout, yeah. It's good. I like that it's very silent here. You feel like home with those sofa seats. It's really nice. I like the cockpit very much. You can have all the information right there. I like the head up display as well. I don't know if you can see it so well from here, but it is really, really good. turning signals great we will make a roundabout then we come back and we finish up this test drive I just want to drive a little bit more just to show you um, and just to make an idea the brakes are good here the bumps it takes the bumps really good I like the feeling very much I like the way it feels up here also you have a very tall driving position so you can see very well around you and you can see uh, things very easily. It's super silent driving in electric mode only. It's very nice, pleasant ride, at least in the city. And even if the motor is kicking in, like now, the motor is kicking, it's very silent. The, this 1.6 liter TGDI, it's a very silent engine and it's a good engine. It's very reliable guys if you ask me so I really recommend you um, Hyundai used this engine as well and it is good very good also the gear shifter I never speak about the gear shifter today it's also six speed gearbox it has one and it's it's quite good it's work really smooth it's work the way it should work when you are in sport mode, it's changed the gear a little bit later. When you are in eco mode right now, it's changing faster and you don't even feel it when, when it's changing. You can hear how smooth it's doing that. In eco mode, you have the perfect comfort. Soft and nice, really, really nice. Very smooth. look in the mirrors guys show you even the speed there it's quite interesting <laughs> on the camera it's show you the speed it's show you what speed you have all right now I have space to go in okay just wait guys wait guys wait guys wait guys sometimes guys if you want to anticipate some accidents you have to look at other people and you have to be careful for other people as well not only for you because if you make your job actually if you drive really good and really safe and you drive uh, correctly the other people doesn't mean that the other people will do that and you have to take care for other people as well for example usually when I brake for example now it's red you know I have to brake and I brake slowly I look in the mirrors if someone is behind me and I try to 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 brake a little bit slowly that the other people in the back to have time to brake as well I try to show him when you are on the highway when you brake a little bit harder just try to put the, 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 the signals because he will know you will brake a little bit harder this is not a rule in the book but it's some common sense that will help you avoid some accidents in the future so 
that's something that I will recommend you extra in this video the ambient light I don't know guys if you see it here it has some uh, snake design and also on the door snake design right here on the handle and it's very nice in the night you have this ambient light also behind the, the buttons you have a nice blue light very nice bluish light and it's so nice also uh, it feels good it feel the ambient in the car it makes sense for example right now I look in the mirrors and then I break because no one was behind me right now it's someone come behind me so I always before I break or when I have to break stronger I look in the mirrors and then I break that's uh, that's my rule so from this point of view also you have two cup holders you have a lot of USB ports here also huge space here guys and also a 12 volt port soft material on the armrest soft material on the on the doors nice uh, buttons on the windows the windows work also very good um, electric adjustable mirrors right now the lane assist is working even here I'm a little bit afraid here to leave it alone because the roads is not so straight but still the car come with a lot of safety features like emergency brake lane assist blind spot technology driver alert uh, system when you are tired for example here they make a lot of noise I cannot hear nothing inside the car because the insulation it's very very good here I go right I turn the signals and then you can see the camera right there super awesome um, this is one of the features that I like very very much and don't forget guys if you want to see the full review with this new Kia Sorento interior exterior check it out on my channel I have there the full review there you find all the information that you need about this car and trust me you will love the car they did a great job here are the big bumps and the car have individual suspension because I feel it right now I actually feel it and oh he's doing such a good job look there in the reverse camera I can see on the cameras right here if I if I turn the signals I can even see not only that cameras but I can see also the other camera look at this how cool is that you can see how many kilometers you have there and you can see also here but you have to drive only when you drive the camera will work if you, you are stationary it will not work so that's a little bit strange but quite nice in the same time I like it to be honest I like that who premium great job let me park it here for a while I want to do another video with the car so you can see it on my channel and then guys we will end up the test drive right here and I hope you really enjoy it I hope you enjoy the video I will leave it a little bit forward just like that okay press the park button now you are in the park electronic handbrake come car come with automatic auto hold it comes also with heated steering wheel and also um, yeah a lot of features here inside you can see it on my channel just check out the other video with the review close the engine and then make the final uh, look how nice is this ambient light here up super nice I like it I don't know if you can see it so well on this camera I hope you enjoyed this test drive with the new Kia Sorento I was really impressed with what this car can do I mean I it's crazy it's crazy good love the suspension great great steering wheel uh, great on the curves even if it's a big SUV you don't feel like a boat um, I think it has this individual suspension maybe some nice link together the axle there I don't know it's just great uh, great suspension the steering wheel is good acceleration it's awesome uh, also I like this system hybrid system great insulation sound insulation amazing seats those seats are just I never go I don't want to go out from this seat I can make the, the holidays here on those seats Christmas and stuff like that I don't know I love them anyway guys I hope you enjoy my video if you have questions ask me if you want to see the full review with this Kia Sorento with the space and all that stuff check out on my channel don't forget to subscribe if you want to see the newest car on the market 
thank you very much to all of you that are watching my videos if you like the music the link is in the description if you have questions ask me anything you want i will answer to you all and thank you for watching i guess i see you soon in the next one stay safe guys drive safe by the way and turn the blinker on see you soon bye guys Thank you.